You know, that's right. This is always going to be a race that was going to favor Congressman Bill Foster, and that is simply because of the power of the incumbency. He was able to vastly out fundraise and therefore outspend his Republican opponent, Catalina Lauf. But even after 10 years in Congress, there were questions about how close this race could get, especially after the 11th congressional district was remapped, meaning that Foster was a relative unknown to more than half of the constituents here with the remap. The 11th now encompasses most of McHenry and Kane counties, parts of Boone Lake, DeKalb, DuPage, Cook, and Will. And during the campaign, Lauf did use the new map to her advantage, calling Foster out of touch with his new constituents, especially those in the more rural areas. And while she was not successful this time around, Lauf is considered to be one of a new generation of Republican candidates that the GOP is trying to cultivate, young, female, Latina, but solidly conservative. Now, Congressman Foster just finished speaking a few minutes ago, thanking his supporters. He is now greeting them here in St. Charles. Tonight, the voters have chosen science and facts and a positive message. And they've chosen experienced leadership over fear-mongering and partisanship. And again, folks, here in a celebratory mood right now, not just because, of course, of Congressman Bill Foster's victory, but also other victories with the party, with the governor and the senator Duckworth winning their re-elections tonight as well. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.